Hello everyone. I'm going to show you how to install Windows 10 Sandbox. This is a lightweight virtual machine that is built in Windows 10 and it is only built into Windows 10 Professional, Enterprise or Educational. It is not in Windows Home Edition. Now you must have at least 4 gigs of memory and at least 1 gig of free disk space to install this lightweight virtual machine. So first of all, you want to right click on your taskbar and click on Task Manager. Click on Performance and you want to make sure Virtualization is enabled. If you don't see this, then you need to go to your BIOS and enable it. So in order to enable this feature in my Windows 10 Professional Edition, I need to go to Control Panel. So in the search bar, I'm going to type Control. Click on Control Panel. And you want to look for Programs and Features. Click on that. On the left side, you want to click Turn Windows Features On or Off. And there's a whole list of features. Scroll down until you see Windows Sandbox. And it's here. You want to enable it by checking it here. Click OK. So now it asks you to restart. You need to restart in order for the Windows Sandbox to be enabled in your computer. So I'm going to click Restart now. So I have restarted my Windows 10 computer and Windows Sandbox has been enabled. Now Windows Sandbox should be listed in the app section of your Windows 10. So if I go to search on my taskbar and type in Windows Sandbox. It's here and it's open. So this is the Windows Sandbox lightweight virtual machine. This has all the basic Windows 10 features. Now this is mostly used for testing uh, exe files or apps so you can go to the internet and you can download whatever files you need or software that you may need so you can download it in this windows sandbox and test it also if you have any software exe files in your main computer you can just copy it and paste it in your windows sandbox virtual machine so I have a couple of exe files here. I'm just going to right click this, copy it, and paste it. So I can copy this Word document and I can also paste it here. So this is how you copy files from your main computer to the Windows Sandbox. You cannot drag it, you have to copy and paste. So this is an exe file, it's just an example. So I just double click it and install it. And it's installed. So I can click on it, I can test it. I can also copy another exe file. I can paste it here. And I can double click and install it. Also there's sound, if I click on the speaker icon, I can get sound.
click on finish and the application was installed so this is how you can test different softwares exe files or apps in the windows sandbox virtual desktop now once you have done your testing everything here will be lost once you close out here it's going to be lost now whatever you have been testing here exe file maybe it has a virus it is isolated from your main machine so whatever is here cannot get to your main machine this is sandboxed right here and it is separate from your main computer so it is safe so it is safe to test whatever exe file or applications or apps that you want to test in the windows sandbox so i'm going to x out and once i click it's going to give me this prompt that are you sure you want to close the windows sandbox and once you close it everything will be discarded and permanently lost so every time you close this everything is gone and then you have to start a new sandbox if you need to test other applications or software so I'm going to click on OK and it's gone so everything has been discarded in that Windows sandbox so I hope this video was helpful to you and I thank you for watching I ask you to subscribe